And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. That means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've gotta find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, still a hothead? Well, some things never change. Select personnel with that in mind. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Toe, now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Yeah, it might be hot and heavy in there. Gus Moda. Yeah, he's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person. Harris. <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. And if this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. Okay. I I'll look into how you can find a tack team and get their weapons, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. All right. I want to say thanks for being a part of our little operation. We're all professionals. We all know the score. We're gonna execute the plan, we're gonna move quick, and we're gonna keep cool. Anybody gets pinched, this meeting never took place. We don't know each other, is that clear? Now, we've um, looked very, very carefully at the plans. We considered something more complicated, but given the location, the weakness of staffing, and the exit points, we believe that a more simple plan will work best. We're gonna hack in, disable security, and waltz right in through the front door. The security guard should be to our left. We neutralize him. 15 seconds later, you come in. I want extreme pressure applied to the staff. The customers are to be calmly subdued. I want one guy on crowd control while you and I empty out the merchandise from the cabinets. We're in and out in 90 seconds, guys. Franklin will handle your getaway. I'm leaving on foot. Any questions? Good luck, everyone. Let's go. Yeah, come on, get in. Paige, you're in the truck with the bikes, everyone else with me. Gus, Eddie, I need you in the back of the van. Franklin's driving, I'm in the passenger seat. Listen up, the four of us in this van, we're about to become accomplices in a major crime. I gotta be able to trust you, my life, my liberty, my reputation. Same goes the other way. A crew will only work, only work, when there's trust. So, in the interest of fostering that type of relationship in the short time we've got, let me introduce myself. I'm Michael. I've done this type of thing before, more than a few times, and I've made good money doing it. Enough to spend a long time not doing it. I hope it goes without saying, I know a lot of people. Anyone yaps about me, 
or any of you, you'll be dealt with. Got it? Good. Now, Frank, over to you. Uh, yeah, man, I'm Franklin, dawg. And, um, I'm new to these kind of planned out detail robberies. I've done my shit small jobs, you know, liquor stores, warehouses, boosting cars. But then I met this dude right here, Michael, man, and he turned me on to this thing. So, who's next? I'm Gustavo Casmota. From East Los, know what I'm saying? It's the bang for the bagos, but hey, don't tell him I told you that. I'm gonna need them homies if I go away. I guess I found out pretty young I could pull a trigger. But it was a couple of years before they started doing it for bread, you know what I'm saying? Instead of that repping with you from bullshit. And here we are. Uh, all right, this is Eddie Toe. He'll be cleaning out the cabinets and handling the getaway. He's got you some bikes for that. All you need to know about him is he's good. What are you freaking out, F? Don't worry. This is it. Let's move. Go get the bikes. Let's go! Ready? This is your moment! Please don't make me ruin all the great work your plastic surgeons have been doing. On the floor, now! Go, 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 go! I'm on the display. things every day, pal. Make sure this is one of them. I'll see you at the river. Go. Let's go! Come on! Stay close, stay safe, let's go! Oh, we got a sharp left coming up on Dorset Drive! Let's move! No, hey, loser. Are you? Oh, are you?
shit, man. We screwed. Hang in there, boys. I got this covered. Keep going. I'll get to work on the cops with these bull bottles. We're clear of the cops for right now. We'll stop at the end of the river, and we'll get the bikes into the truck. F, let's do this. Lester's waiting for us at the lockup. That bike. Yeah, I thought you were gonna be stuck under the cop. There gotta be more dudes waiting around that way. We did not just get away with that shit, did we? You know what? I think we did. Oh man. Oh yeah, we did it, baby. We did it. Yeah, we did it. You know what I'm saying? This music feels like. All right, people. We need to split up. They're gonna be looking for a crew. I'll wire your cuts when the rocks have been sold. That shit was crazy, dog. So what now? We get out of here. Keep our heads down. Hey, you did good, kid. What'd I tell you, Lester, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, look, everybody take off. Hey, Franklin. Listen, Lester and I got some things we gotta clean up. I want you to stop by the house a little later on. We'll celebrate, all right? All right. Okay. <laughs> huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. We're back in action. <laughs> 